This is an example of a synthesis reaction. We're going to take a strip of magnesium and burn it in our Bunsen burner. We're going to use crucible tongs and hold the magnesium in the flame without directly looking. You never want to look directly at the burning magnesium. It's going to emit a very, very bright white light. And so you want to make sure you look away so that you don't damage your eyes um, or vision. So make sure you look away from the flame as it as the magnesium burns. Have a watch glass close by and you'll just let the magnesium oxide, which is the product being synthesized, the oxygen in the air will combine with the magnesium to create magnesium oxide. And it's going to be a kind of a white powder. It will drop onto your watch glass so that you're able to observe the product. So we have the watch glass and one word of caution. Never drop the, the burning magnesium directly onto the watch glass. Hold it and it'll just let it burn until it burns itself out. And it will crumble and the product will hit the watch glass. But if you actually drop a burning piece of magnesium onto the watch glass, you do risk breakage. So use caution. So again, this is synthesis, the burning of magnesium. And now I can release it, and you can see how it just crumbles. And we have some magnesium oxide. That's why the crucible tongs, the tips are, are now white. Magnesium oxide is a, a very soft white substance. So that is an example of a synthesis reaction, the burning of magnesium.